Alright guys, what is going on? My name is Firebrand, welcome back to another video on the channel. This is actually the third time I've tried to record this. I was going to upload a review, but it would be kind of hard without Share Factory and being able to do voiceover without reacting to something. So, and the second time, I freaking forgot it was on 15 minutes, which is nowhere near long enough, because most of these missions make me go over 15 minutes. This, it, Stonehenge, Stonehenge, I know for a fact will take me over 15. Uh, Cape Rainy, I'm not sure if that will take me over 15. For Monty, that was that mission's a pain. I'd hate that mission. That that would definitely take me over to 15. Anchorhead Bay, uh, I think it's just the length of the mission that I don't like. That that is really long of a mission though. Basically, all these missions are long in 15 minutes, so 15 minutes would not be viable. I mean, maybe if the first like, yeah, like see, uh, Roca Roja, that was I think the only reason it's 15 minutes is because that's the amount of time you have to destroy everything. So there's only a couple missions in this game that would be able to do 15 minutes as it is. So anyway, let's get on to the first mission on this. This is going to be a let's play the entire campaign. So if you haven't played the campaign yet and you don't want any spoilers, then watch, Everyone then quit here. watching around the third or fourth episode. If you settle don't down. care about spoilers, then go, go ahead and watch. Said settle down. You have all been instrumental in helping to maintain peace in Yuzha as members of the International Union Peacekeeping Force. Until today. Earlier, our radar site informed us that a group of unidentified aircraft was approaching. Communication systems went down immediately afterwards. We are led to conclude that they have attacked the site. Here's your mission. It's possible that the Yuzhen ceasefire agreement has been broken for the first time in over a decade. As of today, the Fort Gray's Air Base Squadron of the IUPF has been put on high alert. All members who have been ordered to sortie fly there immediately. Find the unidentified craft. Then use your weapons to round them up and force them to land. If the hostiles counterattack, then you will... What the hell was that? There's smoke! We're under attack. Numerous unidentified aircraft have burned overhead. What? How is that possible? The tank farm to the north has been bombed. Many injured. Scramble. All units, take off and eliminate the unidentified craft attacking the base. This is not a drill. Alright guys, so obviously I will be shutting up during cutscenes uh, in the campaign uh, if it's something if, if it's telling me something that I like that is essential like early on like controlling your aircraft or firing missiles or whatever it is then I might shut up during that I'm not, I don't I don't know if I will or not yet I have subtitles on so you can read it anyway uh, I probably won't be doing that just because it, it would get under my nerves oh if I heard had to hear that over and over and over again I, I hope you guys understand but uh, for the most part I will. Be, you know talking over people talking the cut obviously in the campaign if it's not important uh, let's go ahead and start a mission I will be using I already have a lot of planes unlocked though and not a lot I have uh, less than half the planes unlocked there's a lot of planes in this game but I'll be using the uh, F 15 C I think the first one is the uh, F 14 B or it's not that it's definitely not that one is it it might be the F 14 or the F 2 a I'm not entirely sure no, I, I don't. I don't know which one you start with, but uh, I'm gonna go. Ahead and, I'm gonna go ahead and go fly with the uh, F-15C just because that's what most people have early on in the game. I'm gonna see if I can select any parts to make this thing any, you know, halfway better. Definitely want that. Uh, machine gun. I don't really. Uh, that might be, that might be helpful sometime in the later stages of the campaign, but not right now. Yeah, I don't. I don't yaw at all in this game. Uh. I equipped you. Okay, I don't need that. That is basically a necessity. That 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 might be helpful during the later stage of the campaign. I, this a lot of the stuff was unlocked when I was more than halfway through the campaign, so it's not really going to be all that helpful now, as we will you know later on. I don't know what the uh, TLS and the PLSL hit zones are. I don't know what those are. Definitely want that. And wait, what? Oh, small anti-icing D. Get that out of here. Can I take that? Oh, oh no. Oh no. Well, that's kind of sucks, doesn't it? The oh, I see why. It has 36 available for the arms. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, 
Okay, so what can I get out for that? I don't really think I need the new high energy propellant. I don't really think I need that at this point in the campaign. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that out of there for, which one is it? That one. That's the one I want in there. I don't really think I need anything other than that. I think I'm good for the most part on the pitch stability. That might be okay. I'll def de definitely want that. Definitely want that. Can I select a skin? Wait, so the uh, Okay. I'm gonna try not to spoil all those stripes for you. I probably shouldn't have done that. I wanna use the strider skin, but I feel like it wouldn't really be uh that would be a pain to get. I want to use the strider skin really bad, but I also don't at the same time, just because it carry, does carry some spoilers for later on in the campaign. I don't even know what the mage skin looks like, to be honest with you. Yeah, I'll, I'll use the mage skin, why not? Select an emblem, what? Eslovakia! Oh, also, I should probably mention right now that if some of these country names don't make any sense to you, it's because this is an, I think, a fake. Actually, let me get the box over here. Stand by at the front. An alternate unit, an alternate universe with a history steeped in Ace Combat lore. I don't really get the lore because I don't remember really play. I don't remember really very much from my five or six. I don't remember, and I play, barely even played Assault Horizon. So, let's do this. Charge assault. Radar sight still silent. Scramble. Get those birds in the sky. We're sitting ducks. What's happening? Bombers incoming. Don't know how many. Let's clear that runway. We don't the two countries at war are Osea and Yuzia. I think you or Yuzia or how are you say it? It's the it's the one with the starts with an E. You're you're part of Osea and I think the enemy is your Eruja. Eruja. That's how you say. Your call sign is Mage Two. Verify and read back. Mage Two. There's uh this weird targeting first person mode. There's a uh, first person mode, which really the, none of the cockpits look all that good if you're trying to use peripheral vision. It's not. I'm not even trying to the first person in this game to be honest with you. I could see that one. I could see this one being somewhat helpful sometime in the campaign. Whoa. Mage two, form up with mage one. All aircraft, let's do this. Golden squadron, it's go time. Roger that. All right, let's do this. It's gonna be really weird because I have a really good plane for like really early in the campaign. Take down all unidentified bombers. They don't have many escorts. I got you. They hit our radars hard in the last attack. Expect the worst and stay sharp. Welcome. Uh, you. Confirmed down. Good job, Mage Two. Not bad, Mage Two. Thank you. Trigger, switch your radar. See if you can locate the enemy. Ah, found you there. I'm trying to get away from us, are you? Well, we're gonna learn some that I miss like all my shots when I'm going after. Oh, I can't say that because that's gonna spoil it. Crap all on my screen now. They're way overhead. Let's go introduce ourselves. I can't remember if this is single shot or if I can lock on multiples. I think this is single Our shot from what I remember. Your mother's asking for another round. Watch out for the support Yeet. 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 There we go. Destroy the target. Yeet. Target confirmed down. Looking good, mage two. Oh, MiG-21 on my left, alright. I think I have the MiG-21, but I could be wrong. I know I got this. Don't have the one that you need, don't have the one that you think I do. Yeah, cause I'm good at this game, brother. I'm MLG. Oh, you wanna do that, do ya? Well, why don't you get right over here? 
Okay, that was anticlimactic. Oh, that view is less than good. Yeet, yeet. Enemy bomber down. Nice going, Mage Two. Thank you. Not too shabby, Mage Two. But you still got a long way to go, kid. I'll give you some pointers back at base if you can make it in one piece. All the, oh yeah, all these guys are campaign and jerks. For the most part. Copy that. It's a bomber and an escort. Whoa, their trigger. Settle down. Mage two, maintain your element with Mage one. Do not break off. Mage one, make sure he doesn't do anything stupid. Wilco, call him two. Let's maintain element. Copy that, Commander. I've got your six covered, sir. Radio. Target is down. Bad boy, trigger. Gollum, Mage, two new enemy groups. Oh, he's over there. Okay. HQ, attention all combat groups. Are there Ooh, any gosh, a lot of people. Drones? Are you kidding me right uh. now? Jesus, this is the kind of shit that really chaps my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> UAVs, I can't tell them apart. This is going to be the most annoying part in this mission, most likely. Yeah, this is, okay, this is in the squadron, I think it is. The other squadron is the, the one with the drones, which is easily my least favorite part about this game. I hate taking on drones. Oh, by the way, it takes almost two mi I think it takes two missiles basically every time you try to shoot down one of them. Okay, destroy you. Destroy you. That's a miss. Yeah, I knew it. Alright, let's get these guys on this next round. I think there's only two of them left on this part. Yep, two right here. A boom and a boom. One, what? Oh. Shut up, I played through the game before. I know what I'm doing, brother. That's to you. I think I'll to you once it's at the beginning. It's uh, the to you one sixteen or to you one ninety fives. Now I know for a fact that I was just one shot in one sixty just a second ago with this thing. So I'm not taking that crap. Oh, that was a bad missile. So I ain't taking that hit marker bull crap from you one sixty. I was just hitting you guys down with one of these things just a second ago. I'm not taking that. Hey, yeah, boy. Excuse me. Oh, wait. There's one. I'm gonna just finish this guy off with some minigun. There you go. Tell me why a minigun is more effective than, like, putting three missiles. In. No, dude. Feels like five missiles in that, dude. Oh, and I will also be doing uh, all takeoff, refueling, and landing sequences because that gives me a trophy, and, I will, and I'm trying to fight it in this game, but it's gonna be hard to. Slow down. It's just one sortie. Don't try to be a hero. I want you to make it back in one piece. You hear? Yeah, I gotta I got you. Boss man on this. I got you. Golem Squadron, this is HQ. Did you confirm any drones? I did not confirm any drones. What's the deal with all the drones? They're annoying. Golem One, return to base and report for debriefing. Get more get, let's get a more stable altitude. Erugia, I told you guys. Citizens of Erugia. Alright, so that just about does it for that. You can, I, I'm not really gonna, uh, I'm not gonna do that whole thing right there like that. I might do the first two missions just because that first mission is so short. I'm not entirely sure though. It depends on what the next mission is. If it's the one I think it is, then I'm gonna cut it off right here then record again and this I'm gonna be doing this like the Skyrim list I'm gonna do like one episode after another after another after another we have actually no I need to get it I get I need to get my really good A's uploaded we know the attacking bogeys were from Arusha 
International Union peacekeeping force bases all over the Yuzhin continent were attacked in the same way. The damage is severe. Many wars are lost by failing to recover from the opening blows. That means successfully retaliating was very important. You may have turned the tides of battle here. You have our thanks. You know, I'm gonna upload three videos today. I'm gonna upload one in parts one and two for Ace Combat 7, and I'm gonna upload uh, the buck ace I got. Actually, this is, I just I thought this is gonna be really good. I can just replay all these missions and uh, get a lot more so I can get everything I want in the game. Hey, I just not thought that. That's a bet. Because I don't know exactly why I got a solar completion time on my first time. Oh, because uh, oh, okay. I think 1180 was my first. I need to keep start keeping track of score. I think 1180 was my uh, first go through, and my and 11520 was my second go through. That makes more sense. Maybe I'm not entirely sure. Okay, so I, I think I already had an A on that. You, you, okay. So one thing I didn't get last night when I was looking at the trophies was get at least like an A or a B on everything. I didn't know that there were grades on this. I think it's kind of like Resident Evil, but instead of like really confusing like S, A, B, E, D, whatever it is, it's uh, A, B, C, uh, maybe maybe D and F if you do really, 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 really bad. But uh, that's gonna go. That's gonna about do it for the first episode of it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, data viewer. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode, and I hope you guys are gonna start liking this Ace Combat 7 Skies Unknown Let's Play. Uh, I will be uploading again in about, I'd say, half an hour from when I upload the first video. So, uh, again, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys all have an amazing rest of the spring break. And uh, have an amazing weekend. And if you still go to school, have an amazing week. Then... I will see you guys in the next episode. Firebrand out.